Good afternoon, and thank you for joining our session today. This is Valeria Tivnin. Thank you so much for being here together for our meditation session. I ask you, if you haven't done so, to just stretch a little bit your neck or any body part that it might be a little tight today so we can get rid of any knots. And after you have done so, I ask you to choose a position that is comfortable to you. Any position is fine as long as you are comfortable and that you are present and aware. And I invite you to gently close your eyes. But if you choose to keep your eyes open, just gaze them down to avoid any distractions. And together, let's begin with our victorious breaths. Um, I ask you to breathe in through your nose and exhale with a sigh, with your mouth open. And a couple more times, inhale. <sighs> And now I invite you to just soften your breath. I also invite you to pause any mental activities occupying your mind at this time and that you get your full attention to what is most important, your body and your mind. I invite you to bring your attention inward and just soften your breath, letting your body breathe by itself. Letting your in-breath connect you to this moment. And let your out-breath gives you a sense of stillness. And let's start by acknowledging the gentle pull of gravity in our bodies. And also acknowledging and creating an awareness to your body's position, no matter what it is. If you're seated, know that you're seated. And also be aware of your touch points. Perhaps your buttocks in the seat or your feet touching the ground. Or maybe your hands softly placed on your lap. And as you have full attention and awareness to the gravity, your body's posture, and your touch points, 
I invite you to welcome any emotions or thoughts that needs your full attention today. Welcome any emotion or thoughts, but know that whatever you're feeling, that it's normal, natural, and manageable. We're not trying to resolve any issues. We're just acknowledging it without overreacting to it. Acknowledging it without judgment. Just know that it's there. Any feelings, positive or not so positive, pleasant, not so pleasant, because you always have those in our lives as humans, we'll always experience various different feelings and emotions throughout that spectrum of good or not so good. And we will start increasing our awareness in this present moment also by sinking our awareness. And I will start our session today with the Tibetan healing bowls. In the Tibetan culture, it's well known that the vibrations of the Tibetan bowls are great to welcome positivity. So I ask you to pay attention to the sounds that you hear from the bells from the very beginning to the very end as we continue sinking our awareness. Breathe in through your experience with love and compassion and kindness towards yourself.
I ask you now through a soft but deep breath in and out. I invite you to a body scan starting from the very top of your head. I ask you to bring your attention to your scalp and your forehead, relaxing every tiny muscle in your forehead. Soften your eyelids. Relax your cheeks, your lips, and jaw. Observing any tension in your jaw as it is one of the locations in our bodies where tension and stress accumulates. And make sure that your teeth are not clenching and that your tongue softly rests in the bottom of your mouth. Now bring your awareness to your neck, the front of your neck, and the back of your neck, observing any tension any discomfort or any knots in your throat Relax your shoulders without compromising your posture. And relax your arms, your wrists, hands and fingers. Being aware of the gentle pull of gravity in your arms and your hands touch points. Soften your chest and your upper back. Observing your chest rising and lowering peacefully as you breathe in and out. And if during our body scan or any part of our session, any thoughts or images show up uninvited, I ask you to just acknowledge that and let them pass. Let them pass through like clouds in the sky and go back to your breath. Now bring your attention to your stomach and belly. Acknowledging any movement or noise in that area. As the term, I had a gut feeling is not far-fetched there is a strong connection between your gut health and your emotional health.
Now bring your attention to the middle of your back and your lower back. Acknowledging any discomfort, knots, tension, or even pain in this area. And I ask you if you can pinpoint that discomfort, stay with it without overreacting to it. Bring your total attention to that area if you can. Relax your hips, your thighs. Soften your knees. Relax your lower legs and your ankles, feet and toes. Bringing your attention from your big toe down to your little toe. And with another deep but soft breath, I ask you to bring your attention now to your breath, this beautiful biological rhythm of in-breath and out-breath responsible for life. Be curious of the air going in your nose, cool and leaving it warm. Your chest and belly rising and lowering. And see if you can become aware of that small space in between inhalation and exhalation. We're not changing any breathing pattern. We're just observing and letting our bodies do its thing. In breath and out breath. Always letting your body's breathing and your breath be your anchor to any situation. See if you can bring awareness to a full breath from the very beginning to the very end. And to add another layer, let's add loving kindness to the in-breath, loving kindness to the out-breath, or any other mantra that you utilize. You don't have to say out loud. You can just mentally repeat in the in-breath, loving kindness, in the out-breath, loving kindness. Loving kindness, loving kindness, in breath, out breath, loving kindness, loving kindness, stay with it and be patient.
in breath, out breath. Love and kindness, love and kindness, in breath, out breath. In breath and out breath. And it's here that I ask you to now set your intentions for the rest of your day. It is here that you have the opportunity to put it out there in the universe, the beautiful thoughts and wishes and also acknowledging how you can contribute to a more peaceful, mindful day. I also invite you to send your intentions to someone or people who are suffering or who are in need. Feel free to send them your intentions. And I will close our session today with a quote from Viktor Frankl, an Austrian neurologist who endured terrible things during the Holocaust. And he says, between stimulus and response, there is a space. In that space is our power to choose our response. In our response lies our growth and our freedom. I invite you for you to start reconnecting with the world around you, moving your fingers and your toes gently. I thank you for joining our session today. Namaste.